this is Eden once again and welcome to another episode. Okay, so how are you everyone? <laughs> yes, I hope you are happy, safe, and healthy wherever you are right now. Yes, so dani sa bukid nun, by the way, especially sa malay-balay, grabe ka tugnaw. O nga, ako raba, dili ko productive pag tugnaw, as in, gusto ko og sunny day for me. So, ganahan man dyan pong ko og um, tugnaw, nating tugnaw, as long as nagwear ko og comfortable na jacket, nagwear ko comfortable na pajamas, and then medyas da yun. Okay, so, pero pag dili gani ko prepared, and then mag-ulan, um, na, dili jud ko productive lang kaya ako mind. Dayon, ang ako lang po, ganahan ko ting ulan, ganahan kong tugnaw, ganahan, ganahan ko mamina og sound sa ulan. Okay, trivia lang. Char- share ko lang. Ganahan ko mamina, ganahan, ganahan ko og sound sa ulan. Dayon, ah, dayon kay books, dayon music, char muni muni, char ganahan ko ana. Pero again, pag diligan ko ready akong outfit, then mukalit og ulan, then wala ko jacket, na magdiligid na pwede para sa ako ah. Nga, lately, sikig ulan, dani sa bukid noon, dani sa malay-balay, especially. Okay, so, nga, issue kayo siya sa ako ah, as in, nga, sige din ko katulog, isa po na na problema na ako, sige ko katulog, kaya tugnaw ka ayaw. Okay, so, um, I mean, dapat pa dyan matulog. Pero, again, daghan ko requirements no, sa academics na ko. Nga requirements, nga, gawork mangod ko pag morning, and then pag night, no, gaklasi ko. And then mga around 9pm, ako man akong class, um, usahe katulgon din ko, nga, tugnaw. So, wala na, tulog na. Si Miss Eden relente. Wala na kabuhat ang requirements. Dayon, wala na ka-study. Ambot na lang. Okay, so, again, isa na ko na, na medyo enemy, <laughs> enemy, ang medyo katog na won o ang pag-procrastinate, Miss Relente. Problema kayo na ko na siya lately. Okay, so, unsa mo mga struggles ka ron, no? I don't know if you're struggling also with procrastination. Ako, nag-research jud ko, guys. Ang mga talawa ko na hilo na. Nag-research jud ko for me to understand and to help myself as well. So, I hope you will learn in this episode so please keep on listening okay so procrastination everyone put things off sometimes but procrastinators chronically avoid difficult tasks and may deliberately look for distractions again huh? for pro- for procrastinators dihagid na we look for distractions ato ginang choice ang i-distract atong sarili <laughs> is a procrastination tends to reflect a person's struggles with self-control okay so problema na to ang struggle na to ang self-control when we procrastinate so again so sa so makarelate sa ako ah <laughs> Uh, makarelate, no? That is our struggle, self-control and our discipline, no? Sige na to, og, i-distract yun ang atong self, gina-avoid na to ang mga difficult tasks, and too much, no? Na pag put things off. Now, let's try to understand procrastination. Na-understand na ko why I procrastinate lately. Okay, procrastinators are often perfectionists. Hmm, sounds familiar. Okay, si Eden, Rolanda, very perfectionist. Procrastinators are often perfectionists, for whom it may be psychologically more acceptable to never tackle a job than to face the possibility of not doing it well. Agoy, maju ni pag-perfectionista, no? Ato abang... Buhaton na or marong taana kung ato ng buhaton. Hmm, very familiar. So, sa mga nakarelate, ha, no? very perfectionist, usahin mo na itong struggle. Mao di ay ang procrastinate na. <laughs> We are more concerned about what others will think of us than putting our future at risk to avoid judgment. That is our 
struggle jod no sometimes kita mangud na perfectionist our tendency jod kay concern ke kita on saying sa uban no pero to share my experience ako perfectionist ko pero ako ang own critic ako ang kagalingon ra pod <laughs> So, ulit sa dya, asahay, gamater man sa ako ang ingon sa uban, pero if the person is not important to me, o sa dili, kabalong pugod ko mo filter sa kung sa ingon sa uban. No, so, kanang, ang ako alang yun, ang akong kritik, ako ang kaugalingon ng Japan. Asahay, mag Japan akong struggle yun. So, again, for us, no, to understand procrastination, I am very amazed sa akong na-discover sa akong reading na tungod di ay ang mga procrastinators ga-procrastinate kay often they are perfectionists. So, ato anong kailangan i-take note. Okay. So, what are the psychological roots of procrastination? According to some psychologists, no, maong natay procrastination because we have this low self-confidence and then we become anxious and then we have this lack of structure and simply an inability to motivate oneself to complete unpleasant tasks agree we are lack of motivation by ourselves research has also shown that procrastination is closely linked to rumination or becoming fixated on negative thoughts again no let's um not be kuan atong iyul bata atong self with negative thoughts kaya sa haymo na siya makapaprocrastinate sa tua now who is la- most likely to procrastinate do you want to know <laughs> kaya sa people who procrastinate research finds may hold different values than people who do not agree where's our values o sa hay, malim na nata itong values ng mga we procrastinate. In studies, procrastinators report valuing personal enjoyment more highly than others do and valuing a strong work ethic less and are more likely to complete tasks they feel are important to them personally than those that are assigned to them. This is very ouchy for me. Again, kung ga-procrastinate ka, o sa'yo malimtanin mo yung values, at the same time, you value mong God personal enjoyment than um, finishing a task. Agoy. And then, ginapili pa ganyan mo kung unsay convenience sa imuha mo, ito yung unahon. No, aside sa kung unsay assignment ni mo, no, o sa'yo malimtanin mo na kay gusto ni mo itong convenience sa imuha. And that is so wrong. Again, usahay, malimta na ito values because that's why we, so man, we procrastinate. Now, how can I stop or how can we stop procrastinating? Here's a study based on the procrastination at work scale. Okay, so they highlighted there some potential solutions and such of them I would like to share to you. Okay, so first is to adopt timelines that build in time for delay but not too much okay so timelines are very important um sticking to um your schedules again balik kita sa discipline in time management okay, so it's okay naman to have delays but not too much okay so time management kita and then another possible solution no? potential solution that we can do is to make a personal challenge out of that um, huge task. Again, ikaw good personally mo na siya good na nga. nga. I-motivate yung self. I-challenge yung self that you will finish the task. Okay, so another potential solution is to break large jobs into achievable chunks and then celebrate um, what you have completed. So it's very important no to chunk no i chop na to na to ang mga huge task kung pwede mag delegate go and then after you finish a task it's okay to celebrate okay and then last potential but very important solution 
for us ng mga procrastinators. This is very sad, but I hope we will do this. No? It's to limit our access to online news and social media. Okay, so very hard to do. Pero I hope we will discipline ourselves, especially in the using of social media. So before I end this this episode, um, let me share to you Proverbs 3 verse 5 to 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him and He shall direct your path. Um, why did I chose this verse? No, not my own ways. Ako lately na realized ako na siya. Uh, mga all na na-realize na ako na siya nung no? kanang basin galisod ko karon kay I'm depending again on my own knowledge and my own own strength and in my own ways. No, basin wala na po na ako na-acknowledge si Jesus. Maong, ako na po ang gabot buot So, maong, di na kay good ko. Kabalo, manage akong time na po. And, muna siya, gapukasinate na po ko. Kay tungod kay, overloaded na po kayo ko. So, it's okay to enjoy. It's okay to enjoy. Pero, again, kung nakatast, nakawork, or sa ako ang mga listeners, siguro na students right now, no, kung na mga assignments, obligations, let's try to avoid procrastination. Again, our time here on earth is very limited. Let's try to use our time wisely. And again, let's acknowledge God. Let's trust the Lord and lean not on our own understanding. Okay, so thank you so much for listening. I hope you have learned something. So stay tuned for more chicas. Um, if you wanted also to follow me on my other social media accounts, I have my um, Twitter, um, Instagram, and YouTube channel. Pero wala na kayo updates sa YouTube channel. And here on um, Spotify as well, it's at Eden Relente. Thank you so much and stay safe. Again, stay safe, stay healthy, and be productive. Thank you.